the third holy war of the Crusades had been declared. Among the Christian troops was the great army of Richard the Lionhearted, King of England. The fighting was brutal. Back home, the English countryside was being overtaken by local warlords who raped and pillaged indiscriminately, unbeknownst to King Richard and his army, who continued to fight bravely with fading hope of ever returning home. Knights, clergy, and peasants fought side by side like brothers. Among them was a seasoned warrior, a gallant woman, Elizabeth of Cook. hands now, but not the surgeons. Why has her wound not been cauterized? This woman fought with as much skill and courage as any of my men, more than most. Sir, Sir Thomas, uh, help me. I cannot die here. I must return to England. I've uh, made a promise to someone. Shall not endure the pain, my lord. It'll surely kill her. Seal the wound. Thank you, Sir Thomas. You will keep your promise, Elizabeth. Mm -hmm. Welcome home, child. What happened here? Father? Where is he? Father? Father? Where is he? Elizabeth, back to work. Peter. They took everything. There was nothing we could do. Where is my son? Is he? They took him, Elizabeth. I don't know his fate. Who? A brute called Gregor. I have never seen such cruelty. 
yet he carries himself with an air of nobility and privilege, and his men defer to him as if he were the king himself. I'm sorry, Elizabeth. Please, you Lord, did I not fulfill my pledge? Why did you let me live if I won't be with my son? Never, my lord. Come closer, boy. Curious, out of all my men, who would you pick? Sir? Who is my best fighter? <laughs> this is your man. A drunken well keeper, this will be good. What's the matter, Runt? Never sent a man to his death before. <laughs> he doesn't have any arms. He doesn't have a horse.
Expect him to dine with me. Dine with him? My lord, he's nothing but a common slave. So were you once, as I recall. The boy will join us too. Uh, that's Peter, sir. All right, Peter, sir. Tonight you will dine like a king. Elizabeth. Don't try to stop me, Father. I didn't cross the world to fight, only to turn away from the evil in my own land. Come to your senses. You don't even know where they've taken him. The trail of suffering is easy to follow. I hear they come from the north, near Kinshire. You cannot do this alone. Will any of you join me? Us? Fight Grecor? Look at us, Elizabeth. We're not warriors. The best we can do now is rebuild our village and get on with our lives. They took my son. Pray for me, Father. your knees, slave. He may stand. What is your name? I am Luke. Luke? Just Luke, nothing more? I'm an orphan. A son of no land. Well, sit down. We'll have a drink. You may leave now. Here's to the new champion. Your bishop is mine. Just a priest. I don't need him. He's expendable. Tell me, champion, how come a man like you, with no land, can play a game that is only played by a nobleman? Who taught you? A priest. In secret, of course. Of course. My father taught me. Lord Warrington. Most of the land in this region used to be his, but he felt I was an unruly son. After his untimely death, I discovered he had given it all away to the church. He'd left me nothing. No land, no money. Is the name. 
as I watched England's soldiers walk into the Holy War, I saw a chance to reclaim what is rightfully mine. And no one ever challenged me. Not really. But when King Richard's men return, I will need shrewd men with minds sharper than their blade. Like you. Your advance is strong, but even strength has its weaknesses. The game is yours, my lord. Let this be your first lesson. Never leave your king unprotected. And as for you, be loyal to me, and I'll let you share in my wealth. What is your name, woman? Rachel, my lord. Take Rachel with you. She's your reward. If it pleases you, sir. It does. Be gone. Come with me, quick, before more of them come. Who are you? Hunter. Friend. Follow me. Thank God I don't have to fight you. Tell me about Jerusalem. My journey was to fulfill a bargain. With who? In the month before my child's birth, there were problems. I promised God that if my son will be born healthy, I served him when he most needed me. When the holy war was proclaimed, the sign was clear. I always wanted to go into battle. I went to see the priest when I found out about the war, but he just laughed at me. We could have used a woman like you more than the priest could know. Come with me. Help me get my son back. I thought you'd never ask. Spies, bring me troubling words. A priest is telling his flock that paying tribute to me is like paying tribute to Lucifer himself. <laughs> and he's not altogether wrong. 
We ride for Kentshire! Yeah. You said you'd take me to Lastingham. If your legs moved half as much as your mouth, you'd be there by now. You mean walk? From here? Thank God, it's a miracle. Will you help me? If you mean to rob us, you're wasting your time. Rob us? Will be no problem for you. We headed for Kentshire. Not Kenshire. That ugly town? Hi! 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 Don't take it too hard. The crazy old fool thought I was his daughter this morning. Mind how you speak of him. That's Stolem, a member of the Royal Secret Guard. They say the man he protected was killed. Went mad years ago. Not even the mind to save his daughter when Grecker came. I suppose you wouldn't rather go to Lastingham. No, we push to reach Kenshire by nightfall. Right, Kenshire. Though Lastingham is so lovely this time of year. Rachel! <laughs> Rachel, please don't leave me here, I beg you. Pay him a fair wage. And then climb on. You've a good heart, woman. Let's go. Your father with the Dowsy Vale has lately been a stranger to our town. As you have been quite a stranger to Mass, James. Quick. Here at the market! Quickly! Hurry up! I like this place. But it seems the people are not happy. They show me no respect. Sit down. We were in this other town not long ago. The big town, rich, beautiful. A house of many rooms. With good food, good wine, nice women. People were rich and fat. We rode in, we asked them for a little tribute, a little piece of their wealth. What they do, they shut themselves in their homes. So we took it from them. I am a nobleman. I may take like a scavenger. 
Look like a dog, but I cannot have you turn your people against me. Is that clear? Many things are clear. When I return, I hope to see some respect on these faces. The woman with the blanket, take her. She's coming with us. You stay back. John, no! Murderers! Rapists! Lord's vengeance will be upon you. Priest, sire. Make him a martyr. And the rising will plague you in your sleep. Maybe you're God. There's a place for you. Hang from the church. Keep a watch tonight. That'll keep him humble. not right. As though is this quiet? You're asking me? How would I know? I mean, it's not... Yeah. It's odd. What's that? The tavern. It's a good place to start looking. Looking for what? A few good men. Coming? I, um, I'd better not. Exactly what we're looking for. Let's see. Please drink and leave. Men of Kenshire, I'm Elizabeth of Cook. And I'm a man with a lonely bed. <laughs> Gregor has plagued your town, as he has my own and many others. He takes the food we slave to harvest, the gold we toll to earn. He takes our lives and our loved ones as slaves. Enough! We ride to face this man, to take back what's ours. Show your courage. God will be with us to rid the land of this evil. Who of you will join me? Yeah, yeah. I'll drink to that woman. And then I'll deliver your head to Gregor. I had different plans. A few good men. What a shame to waste such a beautiful woman. You could be useful in so many ways. Look. Why don't you put your little sword down and come with me? I'll take you to meet Greco face to face. I'll meet him face to face. It. 
How long did that potion keep him groggy? Groggy? He should be dead. Oh, well, that was exciting. You've killed us all, ignorant woman. You know nothing about me. I know you share company with a thieving whore. How can you insult them? Their courage is greater than the entire town together. Sybil, the other men will learn of this and ride straight to Gregor. What men? They got the priest who hangs at the cathedral. You killed the priest? No. It was Gregor today. Hush, let's go now. Go where? My people had no home, yet Gregor found us and killed my family. He was there. Is that true? <sighs> they were a bunch of worthless gypsies. Who cares? We need some rope. Rope? I'll get it. Let's go see the priest. Take the priest down. Now. Do it. Now what? They're going to bury him. Gregor has my son. The boy. <laughs> Where is he? Oh, he's dead. Walking. Okay. You did. Tonight. <laughs> Where is my son? Greco will avenge my death! Where? Why are you doing this? Greco will kill us all. We won't live in fear anymore. Greco is only a man. Yes, listen to her. You're not one of us, Gypsy. <laughs> you! Look who's with them. What did you do to these people? I stayed a night not long ago. You did all this in one night? That's one way to put it. Let him go. We can't let him go. He'll ride to Gregor. We can't keep him. Look what you've done. If we unite against Gregor, he will fall. What gives you the right to put our lives in danger? Get out of our town. Listen. Leave us now. We'll decide what to do with him. Sorry, I knew they wouldn't listen. They are in the first. Take them to the hiding place and wait a few days before you return. 
You'll be safe there. Come with us. My daughter's here. I understand. Thank you. It'll be a miracle if you succeed, but I don't put it past you. Why do you turn from me, my lord? I'm not your lord. Nor is Gregor. You were in the Royal Secret Guard. I never say those words again. What happened to you, Luke? Why are you here? This is the bottom where I belong. I know the honor of the guard. I also know the pain. My father returned home a broken man. Lifeless, like his soul had been taken. He wouldn't let anybody help him. Slowly, he became yes, a senseless creature. Tell me what happened to you, Lou. I served the Count of Harpton. It was a privilege to protect him. I failed. Who killed him? I don't know. I searched for years, but found nothing. <sighs> Put some more wood on the fire. I'm freezing. All the wood's damp. Is that the stuff you had at the tavern last night? This one has a bit more punch. You're a witch. No. I was raised to know herbs and potions, to listen to nature and his poets. It's the way of my people. Have you anything in your stash that makes a man noble? A good lover? Yes. Humble, no. I'll take all you've got. You seem to have your own way of getting the best for my man. Call it a gift. Not to say I wouldn't care for some of her size. I bet men do anything and everything you say. I've never been with a man. <laughs> That's a whole lot of virgin territory. Explains why she fights so well. A woman never taken by a man holds a special strength. Mm. That explains a lot about me. Is it true what they say about you? I ran away for love when I was young. <laughs> that turned out great. After that, I did what I did best. I made a living. It pays well. Sometimes very well. They don't tend to chase you without their pants on.
Please don't go. I'll be back. I promise. Your cloak kept me warm all night. You must have been cold. The fire warmed me to sleep. I suppose you think the worst of me. I can only judge you since I've known you. Perhaps God's greatest blessing is that every day is full of new promise. And today? Today I'll see my son. Quick. Gregor's men. We can follow their path back into the hills. Take me with you. Why would you go? You know what we are up against. I won't be responsible for your death. What do I have to go back to? Moving from town to town, running most of the time? No. You don't know the hope you've given me. Eve, for once in your life, mind your senses. Yes. For once in my life, let me do something good. Something real, something for someone else besides myself. never spot him from here. I'm going down for a look. Wait. We stick together. I no. agree. No, I'll go alone. Just for a look. Look at my eyes, not my sword. Put your weight where your balls are. better than most men. She went with King Richard to fight for Jerusalem. Bastard. How long has she been gone? A year, but she'll be back. Bastard. Good. Perfect. Excellent. That's my boy. My little boy. Now, let me tell you something. Your mother is not coming back. She promised. She may have lied. She'll never return. That's not true. Forget about her. She might as well be dead. And a true warrior shows no remorse. Did you see Peter? And Gregor. What else? Men. A lot of men. And slaves. Mostly women in dresses. How much of that fire concoction do you have? Only this. It'll do. What's the plan? Hunter and I get them stirred. As soon as we do, someone needs to grab Peter, someone close, inside the camp. You mean me? Us. We'll fit right in. We'll make sure they're busy. Then keep the escape route clean. Any questions? How will we know it's Peter? We'll know. He's perfect. He's an angel. And tell him... Tell him his mother kept her promise.
now. is here. She's come back for you, just like she promised. My mother is dead! No, Peter, she's... I found one of them! She's in here! Elizabeth. Come on. Go, go, go. Hide yourself, woman! Well, bread, fair skin, nice smell, spirit, pride, 
They tell me you fight like a man. Who sent you? Rape them slowly, one by one. If this lady decides to talk before it's her turn, she might be worth saving. We might need a stool for this one. <clears throat> They're only hired hands. I'm the one you want. Really? I want the truth. No stories. Send you. No one sent me. I'm here because you took someone. Well, who is it? What's her name? Her sister, maybe. I'll bring her on. My lord. What? Get my horse ready. We'll deal with them when we return. And no one touches them. <laughs> Lauren? Need my helmet, gloves? And the other sword. What is it, sire? We're going back to Kentshire. I've lost quite a few of my men. They tied Onsgar to a tree and buried the damn priest. I can ride. No. No. You proud of yourself? You saved my life. Good man. My son will ride with me. Is this mine? Yes. I found your ore stoop. Now go get on it. The dagger had the seal of Harpton. Yes. I watched him die. You killed the Count of Harpton? None of my enemies live very long. Such is over. dragged me here recently. Uh, wrong hut. Wait. You were with them, weren't you? The women invaders. Do I look like an invader? I can call the guards. There's a boy here. I, I came with his mother. We just want to get him out. Peter? That's him. Oh, his mother. But Peter just rode off with Greco. Oh, damn it. Wait. Most of the men went with them. There are hardly any left in camp. At least we can set his mother free. We need weapons, something we can sneak to them. How? Just get me to them. Trust me. No one enters until Greco returns. He told mm -hmm. us to make sure that they had water before I left. You as well.
Hey, I haven't seen you before. That's because Greco keeps me locked away in his hut all for himself. You know how he can get a little crazy. Greco isn't here right now, is he? It's a good thing I made you come along. Thank you. Peter has your string. Where is he? He's gone to Kenshire with Gregor and his men. Not Kenshire. Wait. The people there, they rose up against him. They did what? Really? It'd be wise to wait till they return. They'll be tired, wounded. She's right. Even still, this is not the best place for an ambush. What do we do? I don't know. I know someone who would. So, you've decided to be Peter's mother again. A little late. Better late than never, I suppose. Why do we need him, whoever he is? He was a member of the Royal Secret Guard. He wants to see Greco dead as much as you do. I'm not impressed. Sorry. <laughs> Besides, Greco treats the boy like his own flesh and blood. Don't be surprised if Peter turns to him as a father over you as a mother. How dare you? A child could never forget his mother. Look, a year is a long time for a boy. Not even if it was a lifetime. You can't fight Greco here. You'll all be killed. I'd do anything to get my child back. Your passion runs deep. But not your strategy. You've proven that. Now, given the right place, yes, we can beat them. But not here. What if there was a place? Could you deliver him? Of course. Why should I trust you? You don't have a choice. My son is everything to me. If that were true, you wouldn't have left him. Stop it. Luke, this is your chance. Don't become like my father. Enough, Rachel. Rachel? Your father's Dolan? How do you know that? Dolan. Good mad because he failed to protect a life he vowed to protect. Perhaps not so different from you. Is that what you want to hear? Yes, the man I protected was killed. But far worse. I've discovered the man I'm serving. It's the very murderer I've been seeking all these years. I'm sorry she brought you here. We'd be fools to want my help. What about a castle? High walls surrounding the main courtyard. A drawn gate, the only entrance. Given a blind ambush? Perfect. Then it's time to get rid of Krekar. Sure, he comes after us. That's all. I want to come with you to help you fight Greco. No, you've done enough. As soon as we clear the hills, ride back home to your families. I'll stay. Could take care of your father, Rachel. Good luck. I'll see you at the castle. Ride hard. Get ready. We won't be far behind you.
Elizabeth? It's Elizabeth! You are as strong as you are stubborn. Did you kill Gregor? Where's Peter? Peter is alive, as is Gregor. With hope they follow us. Follow you? To the castle? Yes, Gregor is coming back here. And sure as you live within these walls, my family builds, you will fight. What are you afraid of? Let's fight. Gregor killed my people, my family and my friends. I will fight. Fight for those he enslaved. The women who were raped, the children torn from their mother's arms. Fight! Has Satan grabbed your tongues? Speak up! I will fight. I will fight. I will fight. Yes, I will fight. Fight. We don't have much time. Chair is burning. Their leader is dead. That'll teach them. How are you? Where is everybody? The women prisoners killed all the men, freed the slaves. Then why are you still alive? I have a message. I know where they're going. Where would that be? Castle in the region of Cook. That's it. It's his mother. The same woman from Kentshire, sire. My life is in your hands. She wants to see her boy one last time. So be it. Come here, son. It's time to, to rest. Do you think Gregor will come? Gregor is close. And Peter? He's with them. I'm afraid I've lost him, Father. Peter? Never. Your love and your strength brought him into this world. 
your hearts are as one. New. Oh, warrior angel of England. Don't you want some armor? And wrinkle my dress? I'm so nervous. All this waiting. They'll be here soon enough. And you'll wish you were back here waiting. The calm before the battle. You're the bravest souls I've ever known. Peter. There it is. Your old home. Your mother is in there. Peter, you're not a child anymore. This is the time to find out if you're a real warrior. The gate is open. No one stirs at the wall. Claim victory. Keep the spoils. I've never seen such bravery and foolishness. I'm going to kill you, Gregor. <laughs> well, Mother, here's your son. Let us see if he will return into your arms. Come here, Peter. Come to me. I've done my duty. I lay dying with only the thought of you to keep me alive. Please, Peter, come to me. Surrender. It'll save a lot of blood. Ride out these walls with me and learn to be my woman. You'll never leave this walls alive. Take her. Kill the others. Archers, aim sharp. For your mother. No! Yes. Oh. Oh. Peter!
that's who you are. Hampton's God. He begged. <laughs> Mind your senses, child! He squealed like a girl as they pushed his own sword through his gut! <laughs> Go. I'll be back. Go. Stay back! Yeah! 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 
Peter. No, don't Run. kill her! I heard a rumor you fight better than most men. Did you? Though you hardly need a sword to bring a man to his knees. Charming. But there is already a man in my life. Never said you need a man. But a good dance, perhaps. 